solve for x squared minus nine equals zero. Now this quadratic equation is already in standard form, equal to zero. So we'll begin by factoring the expression, four x squared minus nine. Notice that's difference of squares. The perfect square factor here is two x, and the perfect square factor for nine is three. Therefore we can factor this difference of squares, 2x plus three times 2x minus three equals zero. Once we have it factored, we then apply the zero product property and set each factor equal to zero. So either 2x plus three equals zero or 2x minus three equals zero. At this point, we solve each linear equation separately. Subtracting three on both sides of the equal sign, we're left with two x equals negative three. And then dividing here by the coefficient of x, two, we obtain x equals negative three halves. That's one solution. Now similarly, we can add three on both sides of this equation, two x equals three, and then divide both sides by two. X will then equal three halves. So this quadratic equation has two solutions, negative 3 halves or positive 3 halves.